Hello people, my name is Zach. I'm one of the LNAR drivers based at London King's Cross. One of my routes is King's Cross to Leeds and today I'm gonna to show you what it's like from my point of view. You ready? Let's go. Welcome aboard, but this time from the front seat, I have to say it is the best seat in the house. Now, London King's Cross is going through some really big changes to allow more trains to leave and arrive more quickly and efficiently. So things are going to look very different soon. This service is heading to Leeds. We're straight into Gasworks Tunnel as soon as we leave, which is the first of nine tunnels between here and Stevenage. Stevenage is actually the first station we serve. Here's a challenge for you. What is the first station we go past on the line after the line speed changes to 125 miles an hour for the first time? Comment down below if you know, unless of course you're another driver. As we leave the last of the tunnels, we start to speed up to 125 miles an hour for the first time. If you've got the answer already, well done. The first station we pass at this speed is Nebworth. Nebworth isn't a station we serve, but it's used by a lot of our drivers as a reminder that we're getting close to the first station that some of our services stop at, Stevenage. So it's 125 miles an hour most of the way to Peterborough until we start slowing down again around the lovely fields of Stilton Fens. There's actually a big arrow on the left around here that says 5 miles to Peterborough. See if you can spot it next time you're travelling. As you get closer you'll notice the city of Peterborough come into view and you might want to look out for things like Peterborough Cathedral which you should be able to see on your right. If you're getting off you should probably be getting your things together. Here is Grantham, the next stop on our route. It's not very far from Peterborough, and if you're getting off at Grantham, you'll know we're getting close as it's right in the middle of Stoke and Peacecliff tunnels. And when we're not stopping, we're flying through at 100 miles an hour. Newark Northgate, our next station, is only a short distance away from Grantham but our trains are fast enough to get up to 125 miles an hour again very quickly. It's also where our Lincoln services turn off to the right. Some of our other services fly through, but we all still have to slow down to 100 miles an hour for Newark Flat Crossing, just after the station. Newark Flat Crossing is an almost perpendicular junction where other trains from Lincoln go past towards Newark Castle, and we fly through towards Retford, the next station on our line, and beyond. Here, we're approaching Doncaster. It's one of our driver depots, so you might spot a driver changeover happening here. This is also where our Edinburgh, Newcastle or York services carry on on the main line while we head off towards the left to Leeds. It's a short half hour journey to Leeds from Doncaster. My colleagues based in Leeds might take over to go towards Harrogate, Skipton or Bradford. But once we get here, I'm off for a break and to do it all again back to London. Hope you enjoyed the journey. Don't be afraid to say hello if you recognise me in the stations. See ya.